Hi guys! So I have not done a video in which seems forever for me. Um, I haven't done a video in like a week and some days. So I um, actually got a request to do a Gerber's um, like a rice cereal tutorial. They're very easy to make. Like, um, I highly recommend these for breakfasts for babies and stuff like that. Um, so today I will be. Uh, I will be doing a tutorial on that. So, um, the one I'll be making is cherries and berries five grain cereal. And all you do is really add water. And this is what the package looks like. And it looks like really good on here, like for babies and stuff. But it looks nothing like that after um, you make it. Like, it doesn't really have a lot of fragments, like of the cherries and berries in it. But I would highly recommend this for any um, baby for a quick snack. They also have an orange an orange one like this and it looks it's like orange and then has like fragments of um like mango and pineapple and stuff and I have yet to bought, buy that one for her but um so this is a nutrition facts. It has a lot of healthy stuff well it has it's twenty five percent calcium, a hundred percent iron, as eight percent vitamin E this Simon or whatever it's called is 160%, so. Vitamin B6 is 110%. Vitamin B12 70%. So it's like, it's really healthy for um, babies. And it says it's designed for toddlers from 12 months. But I use it for an 8 month old baby, so. And she loves it. Okay, so I've actually already made it. I'm just going to show you guys what you need and what you need to do. So, of course, you need your rice cereal. This tutorial is good for any kind of rice cereal. I think someone's at my door. Okay, um, so you're going to need hot water. And I just finished boiling this. I don't know if you can see, but um, there's steam still coming up. Um, so you need hot water. You're going to need um, either a spoon. You're going to still need a spoon. But these are... Um, teaspoons and tablespoons and this is what I use to measure it and I just need um, that much so I used a one, one teaspoon of um, rice cereal formula stuff so and a little bit of water and you're of course going to need a bowl or plate or whatever I would recommend doing it in a bowl because I've tried it in a plate it works but I don't know if you want to make a lot it's not good on a plate um, I just use this little one because she sure already ate and stuff, so. Okay, so, and of course you're going to need a spoon to mix it. So what you first do is you add the water to the rice cereal and you stir it and it um, forms instantly as long as you've put a lot, like, enough rice cereal in it to form. So I'll show you guys what this looks like. Oh, sorry. So this is what it looks like. So, as you can see, it looks nothing like the picture. Um, it has some fragments of, like, cherries and berries in it, as you can see. It's more of, like, a review on it. Oops. Um, it smells great, but does not smell, like, um, berry-ish or cherry-ish, I guess. Um, but it's very good. And what I like to do is add, um, baby food, or, like, this is the blueberry dessert baby food by Hens. Um... And I love to add this with the rice cereal, and you mix it in, and it adds more flavor. Um, I haven't tried it, but I know she likes it a lot, so. This is what it looks like, and this is very cheap. Oh, it looks like I've never opened it, but I'm pretty sure I did. Sorry, just one sec. Yeah, I have. Alright, so this is what it looks like. And it smells like blueberry jam. So, um, oh, I don't really want to get... Okay, I'm just going to... Add, I'm just gonna like, cause I want to get the formula in here. So just I'm just adding one teaspoon of it in. This is an add-on. You don't have to. You can use any kind of um, dessert, baby food, or I've also used the squeezy packages in this. I've used the banana and kiwi, and the blueberry dessert. Those are the only ones I've used so far. So you just stir it in and like. Sorry, I gotta put this down. This I gotta put this down for one second. And it, like, it mushes in good. So, it doesn't look much different. Maybe a little darker, but... 
It smells more fruitier too, and I'm sure it tastes a lot better because it has like some like extra flavor. Sorry, don't mind my Furby. Um, so yeah, so this is the tutorial on how to make rice cereal, which is super easy. So, but I mean, I guess if you want to see what this one looked like at the finishing touches, I guess this is good to watch. Um, so I basically just bought this because I looked at it and it looked really good looking and it looked so pretty. So, but it does not look like that at the end. Um, so yeah, so thanks for watching. I hope you found this helpful. This is like more of a review rather than, um, I guess, how to make it. I mean, it's showing you how to make it, but yeah. Okay, so thanks for watching. Bye.